CBS Sports put out an article with their Pac-12 coaches rankings, and you won't believe where they place Coach Prime. So we're going to talk about it. Stay tuned. Guys, please do me a favor. Before we get into this video, please give us a like, comment, share, and subscribe. Also, hit the bell notification so you can get updated on my latest content as it drops. All of that will be greatly appreciated by me. Okay, so it says here, each season, CBS Sports and 247 Sports college football teams get together and rank every single Power 5 coach ahead of the upcoming season. The Pac-12 saw a handful of handful of coaching changes during the offseason headlined by Deion Sanders leaving his position at Jackson State with hopes of reviving a dormant Colorado program other coaching changes in the conference includes Arizona State hiring Oregon offensive coordinator Kenny Dillingham to replace Herm Edwards and Stanford replacing David Shaw with Sacramento State coach Troy Taylor both coaches are in full rebuild mode with their respective programs. The rest of the rankings remain relatively unchanged. Washington's Kalen DeBoer, Washington State's Jake Dickert, and Oregon's Dan Lanning all took steps forward, while Cal coach Justin Wilcox dropped a few spots. USC's Lincoln Riley and Utah Cal Whittingham occupy the top two spots for the second consecutive season. Here's a look at all the Pac-12 coaches and how they stack up. So we're going to get down to see where, um, of course, they're going to have Lincoln Riley at number one. I'm not disagreeing with it. They have Coach Prime at number seven. It says here you can make an argument that Colorado will be the most fascinating team in America this season. That I agree with. Using the transfer portal, Sanders completely transformed perhaps the worst power five roster into a brand new team in one offseason. Whether it works remains to be seen. Colorado has a tough non-conference schedule with games against Nebraska and TCU, but there will be a lot of eyeballs staying up late this season to watch Sanders experiment. Colorado may reap the benefits of um, Sanders roster overhaul right away, but it could nevertheless be a team to watch in the Pac-12 moving forward. All right, so, you know, these rankings, for me, it doesn't really mean much to me. And I understand why they got the other coaches ranked pretty high because of what they did last season. And I'm, I'm okay with that. You know, um, if, you, if you're comparing last season, of course, rank them Lincoln Riley, excuse me, Lincoln Riley pretty high. We're going to wait till midseason. Uh, once midseason, like I would, I think what I'm going to do after the first five games of the season, I'm going to come in with my rankings. I'm going to do player rankings. I'm going to do um, college, I mean, foot, I mean, football coach rankings. Actually, I'm going to do the college football coach rankings, the Pac 12 college football rankings after the season is over. After the bowl games are completed, then I will see where uh, Coach Prime ranks then. All right, so where are we at? So, like I said, um, these rankings don't really mean much to me. I think he's a much more of a valuable coach than they're giving him credit for. Actually, they know he's a valuable coach, but they um, they they choose to not even talk about it for whatever reason. But um, they saw what he did at Jackson State, even though they're minimizing what's going on. But like I said, since he's new to the Pac-12, I'm okay with the rankings. Um, we got a whole season to play. All these teams, we all start out at with the same record, 0-0. Zero, zero. And we're going to see what happens this season. Oh, don't let them beat USC. Listen to me. Don't let them beat USC, man. It's they already the biggest talk, talk and draw in football right now. Let them start knocking off some teams people don't think they got no business knocking off. Oh, you're going to hear about it from me cuz I'm betting on Colorado this year. You're going to hear from it definitely. You're definitely going to um hear a couple videos on my success in these sporting um betting um apps. But coach Prime He's ready to go. He's getting the team ready. This summer is moving quite fast, man. Next thing you know, they're going to be in training camp. And um, things are going to uh, be on from that point. But everything is up, man. T ticket sales are up. Merch is up. Everything is up right now. Everybody's excited with to, to see what the possibilities are this season. But on what say you? All right, y'all. Thanks for watching, guys. But before you go, please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Also hit the bell notification 
so you can get updated on my latest content as it drops. If you have any video ideas, feel free to leave a comment below. Take care.